Well, good evening, ladies, lasses, and lasses, and welcome to the click you smell astounding today. And don't let anyone else tell you otherwise. Who could ever be disgusted by your beautiful smell? But let me talk about what do disgusts me. That is right, the lack of historical knowledge in today's youth. Those darn kids aren't old enough to experience history. So today we are gonna go through our slash fake history, which is gonna be a glorious experience. If you ever wanna do like a PhD on history, Read this is the video for you. <laughs> Don't mind the title. Enjoy. <laughs> oh, it's gonna be horrible. <laughs> First openly gay couple in Russia, 1993, colorized. Oh my god, look at that, it's so beautiful! <laughs> Imagine this though, like an alternate timeline. What would the world look like? Let me know down in the comments. It would be sparklingly beautiful. Elon Musk teaching his children, 2016, colorized. Proud dad tweet, taught my three-year-old about investing this morning. He could either have half a gummy prior to nursery, or he could leave it there and have two in the afternoon. He chose the latter. So proud. I ate them both once he left though because hashtag volatility. Take that kiddo. You see sometimes there are external forces that have messed up your life and gummy bears no matter what you do. So trying is the first step towards failure. That <laughs> today's wholesome lesson. <laughs> Moving on. Okay, no, no. I think it's more like, you know, sometimes stuff happens that we can't help, but, but you know, you should still try. <laughs> God, this video is awful. The UK Conservative Party start rejoicing about how to win over young voters 2015. Minecraft proves that abolishing child labor was a mistake. The children yearn for the mines. If I have ever seen an argument for child labor, this is the one. Oh, yes, indeed. If the nine-year-olds do not enjoy working in the coal mines, explain Minecraft then, checkmate, liberal. Ooh, I want to see the similar argument from the military. Look at all these kids playing FPS games. <laughs> the child soldiers, baby. <laughs> Hell yeah. July 2017. CDC confirms cure for depression and suicidal tendencies. That is just... Wow, beautiful. Let's dig into this scientific discovery together. A guy goes to Mexico to do the non-aliving himself, spends week doing coke and banging people who sell their services, decides to keep living. $2,000 spent on a trip to Mexico, a cab ride, a steedy, <laughs> a seedy hotel room, excessive amounts of cocaine, and people who sell services for money, or geez, <laughs> legitimately saved a man's life. I mean, I can kind of, I kind of see how that would like jank you out of, 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 of like, a, of a, a spiral or something like that. Maybe, maybe it doesn't work for it. Seems like <laughs> CDC, you have really damn man, <laughs> damn. In an act of great courage, this man refuses to stand up and perform the Nazi salute. In April 1945, he will be executed by Hitler himself. Let's see now, who is this historical? Oh yeah, that's technically correct though. That is, yeah. I mean, it's yeah, t technically. <laughs> I would love to have a program where you have historical lessons presented like this with stuff that is technically correct, but it's just really confusing and weird. That would be so much fun. I love that. Russian president Putty visits Russian most prestigious male splooshy bank 2016. Let's see. Oh. Oh, okay. Mm. Very yummy. Yes. Oh, oh, a bit more. Yeah. Okay. Oh, it's a gif. It keeps going. Great. Well, that's beautiful. You know, we gotta, gotta test the product. Isn't that what you do? You go in and be like, hi there. We would like to purchase some of this stuff to create a baby. Can I have a sample to see if it's... If it's good, moving on. Mark Zuckerberg visits the therapist, 2015. So here's the therapist going in the back of the head with the little alien boys. <laughs> with his little levers and stuff. That is amazing. You see, even the creatures like Sucky Wucky needs his... <laughs> It's mental health. Normalize going and having mental health sessions. It's good for everyone, <laughs> even for, even for <laughs> sucky wacky. <laughs> Segregation in America, 1950. No colored pencil, regular pencils only, colored pencils only, SMH. Martin Luther King didn't die for this. This is absolutely disgusting. You see, history really has its up and downs, and this is a severe down. Shame on you. <laughs> Pencil segregation. <laughs> Tehran man before the Iranian revolution, 1969. Oh, 
Oh, well, <laughs> oh my, well, it's getting a little bit, uh, a little bit hot in here. Good thing I am not wearing pants. Warner Bros. unknowingly starts the deterioration of Western culture by inventing furries, 1996. Oh, <laughs> well, <laughs> hello there. Mm. Oh, yes, indeed. Is this a conspiracy? It's like, oh my god, this is a conspiracy. This was planted in the West to make sure our culture would be weak. And we would have a bunch of furry beta males when we go to war. Okay, hear me out here, fam. Hear me out here, fam. If I ever get to the point where I have, like, too much money that I don't know what to do with it, I'm gonna make a series, like on Netflix or something, where every episode is creating a mini-movie out of the wildest conspiracies I have found online. The first episode is gonna be literally furries were planted in Western culture to make sure that our army would just be full of fursuits by, <laughs> by the next war, and then, like, how that whole thing develops. That'd be so much fun. Isaac Newton publishes Laws of Physics, 1689. I like him thick AF. But, but Sir Newton, we can't write that. Hmm. Then write this. The greater the mass, the greater the force of attraction. Yes, indeed. Oh my god, it's all about that thickness. The law of attraction, get out of it. Law of thickness. The thicker the body, the more it attracts other thick bodies. Trust me, I am an engineer. Obama administration finding Osama bin Laden, 2011. Oh, look, he's over there. Oh, gee, here you found me. This is... The <laughs> what is this picture? It's so... I would, I would love to know the context behind this picture. It's so freaking random. What the hell? Sentinel Island is attacking a helicopter, 2005. Damn, they have really come a long way. They even have, like, Bud Light and stuff. That's... That's impressive. Wow. Sentinel Islanders, you... You go, go fam. Donald Trump decides to become a Republican and later plans to run for president, 1998. I spilled baked beans all over myself watching Cars 2 in theater and a black teenager shouted, this n-word eating beans and everyone laughed. That's when I decided to become a Republican. Uh, Donald Trump, People Magazine, 1998. <laughs> eating beans in a theater. I mean, honestly, I would bring a can of cold beans in the theater. It just matches my soul. Somewhat slimy, cold, and, and in a really hard exterior shell because you don't let anyone in close or know the deep, dark secrets that you're storing inside. Oh, those sweet beans. Moving on. First color photograph of Jupiter, 1991. Look at that beautiful large planet. Zoom in on that bad boy. Wait a second. Those are ducks. Oh, <gasps> there are ducks on Jupiter. Oh my God. You know what? We have a new project, SpaceX and all that amateur BS. Screw that. We are going to Jupiter to rescue the giant ducks. <sighs> my life calling is here. Wish.com opens for business, 2010. My boyfriend got me a hempty tight ring that breaks when it absorbs too much negative energy from my life. <laughs> it only took a month and I needed a new one. I need to start selling poor quality products and marketing them like this. That is genius. When you have something so crappy and you turn it into something good, it's literally, this is literally embodiment of it's a feature, not a bug. Oh my god, your TV screen caught on fire after one hour of use. That's just because you have so much negative energy, bro. Don't you just feel better already? You just sucked it right out of your butt. Look at this man and he's really happy because man proposed to other man with a bouquet of weed flowers, 1969. Damn, the 69, nice. It really had some stuff going for it. This is absolutely beautiful. I love when history is just like beautiful and wholesome and accepting and just hashtag goals. Ha. <sighs> Gorgeous. I can tell why he's so happy. It's just mm, beautiful. R slash political compass memes is created. 2014. This is David 16. Racism. Anger issues. Gamer. <laughs> oh dear God. One thing I remember though from like the early days of online gaming and lobbies and trash talking and stuff is how freaking common like really bad words were, they were so incredibly normalized to the point that you didn't think they meant like anything. It was ridiculous. And someone who came into it who wasn't a native English speaker and like the pure, the pure density of like slurs and stuff is like, oh, everyone uses this all the time. Seems normal. It's like you got desensitized to trash talk. Man, like 2005, wild times, man, wild times. Humanity invents Christianity, 33 AD. We should just pin all the debt in the world to one guy and then kill him. <laughs> 
that's basically what they did. It's like, oh my god, all oh, your naughtiness and bad stuff. I just get <laughs> a stab. Absolutely amazing. I wonder how that would work in the economy, though, like all debt, because a lot of stuff in the economy is driven by debt, but also I don't think all the debt holders would agree because it basically means that all the debt would just be void, I suppose. So, <laughs> not sure if it would work very well. I think it would have some consequences, but like, it's an interesting concept. If we have someone willing to do the sacrifice, basically Jesus 2.0, but for money. <laughs> Royal Navy Battleship, estimated 1918. Here, Taylor Swift's dazzling camouflage meant to break up her shape against the background, making it difficult for German U-boats to ascertain her range, speed, and direction. Oh my god, you go Taylor Swift. What's your favorite warship? Mine is Taylor Swift. <laughs> Ukrainian Special Forces enter Crimea 2017. That is, uh, that, mm. <laughs> This subreddit is genius, man. It's so good. I love this. Nikolai Tesla roasting Thomas Edison, 1890. My son has been eating electrical cords. What do I do? <laughs> Ground him until he conducts himself properly. <laughs> Got him. You see, the main thing about this that I'm concerned about is how similar the Twitter UI back in 1890 looked to what it does now. Twitter dev team, you gotta, or Musky Husky or whoever, gotta step it up, man. Damn, the UI hasn't changed in... 130 years. It's slow. Archimedes discovers geometry. 250 BC. I put soy sauce in this sushi lid and it looks like an iPhone. I love discovering things like this. Look at this. Look at this iPhone soy. It looks like an iPhone. My brother in Christ. That is called a rectangle. God. Let me know in the comments if you, for example, have ever used like a roller phone. You know those things where you poke your finger into a hole and, it, and then. I think there are series about that on YouTube already, but like, very young people using very old people things, and very old people using very young people things. Oh, it's so fun to see the disconnect, man. It's so fun. I think the funniest tweet I've seen in a while is someone who's like a dad, and their seven-year-old is just like, But you used, you used paper to navigate in the past? Just like pirates? It's like, well, it's... A, it's a, all right. All right, you got me. Circa 1962, creation of the MAD doctrine. People always say cyclists need to be more afraid of cars because in a collision, the car wins. <laughs> it doesn't have to be like that. We can both lose. Oh, look at that. It's a little bomb cycle. <laughs> Well, this creates my much more interesting dynamics in traffic. It also makes you look out for pedestrians, kind of like, well, you, know, you never know who's just gonna blow up if you hit them with your car. Maybe this is the true incentive that we need in traffic for people to behave decently. Road rage is not gonna be a thing when things can spontaneously combust. You know, it's all about escalation, how escalation, how willing you are to escalate things, and I don't think a lot of people are willing to escalate to this point. A Turkish government's top secret plan to join EU, declassified 2005. So look here, we have little country, Turkey, and then we have little gap here, and we just move it here. And it's very easy. And then you just glue it together. Duct tape is also acceptable. <laughs> very easy. Hashtag Assassin's Creed Odyssey lets you be as gay as you want. This takes place in ancient Greece, right? The Greeks followed religious doctrines, so they would kill somebody for being gay. Therefore, in this series, which prides itself on historical realism, apart from characters having an impact, it's gonna add this, it's wrong. Lol, you think ancient Greece wasn't gay? I know ancient Greece followed Christianity. Ah, oh, ancient Greece followed Christianity approximately 70, 80 BC. <laughs> ah, Twitter. The historical accuracy, mm -mm. Just the source material we... No, nobody asked for. Do FBI agents meet a Secret Service agent? 1953. Oh, you're like camouflaged inside of the clothes? That's very sneaky. I like that. Beautiful. The two founders of Reddit announced their website on TV, 2005. Virginity rocks! Yeah! Nobody touched my virginity! My virginity is like a Charizard first edition, shadowless, and ain't nobody taking that card from me. Thank you very much. Angela Merkel asking Trump where he hid the cookie jar, 2017. Now tell me, Trumpy Wumpy, where did you hid the cookie jar? I ain't telling nobody. It is my cookies. Mine. This is absolutely beautiful. This is basically how... <laughs> How global politics work, man. It is basically this level of like complexity. Like, oh, god damn it. <laughs> God's making the first British person, so we have a normal person and Britified. Oh yes, indeed. I sincerely apologize to all the Brits in the in 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 the audience. This meme is really something to sink your teeth into. <laughs> Adam Smith introduces the concept of economies of scale, 1776. 
After six weeks, $140 in supplies and daily watering, we're only three to four weeks away from enjoying a single 25 cent vegetable from our garden. That, that's basically what it feels like, man. I was so proud when I started growing my own chilies and stuff, and then you realize that, oh gee, I bought pots for like 50 bucks, and then I bought dirt for an under, like, I don't know, 10 bucks, and then I bought the seeds, and then I watered it for a long time, and then all that kind of stuff, and look at this, after like six months, I have one little chili fruit that would have cost me 25 cents in the store. Time well spent. Geneva Convention, 1949. Humans and germs <laughs> signing into law the five second rule. Oh, that's amazing. I love this. <laughs> this could also be a movie. That's so good. Trickle-down economics is invented. 1369 colorized. So here is rich person sh**ing down a hole, and poor person gets to enjoy the scraps. Look at that, you can even have multiple sh**ers on the castle for multiple poor people to just lick up those delicious scraps. Oh yes indeed. Stephen Hawking's first day as a professor at Caltech, 1974. Today is the day we take the stairs. Mm. Senator Mitch McConnell waves at the crowd as he's re-elected for the fifth time, circa 2014. Look at that, what a good boy, he's looking very fresh. Mmm, nice. American children preparing to enter elementary school, 80 AD colorized. Now children enter formation, yes, teacher, omission, it is important that you protect all angles. I wonder what the context to this is. It must be like a school show or something, it's re <laughs> it looks really good. They've really got in for it, they even got the shape of the shields. What did they, did they like cut small barrels in half? Is that how they got the shields? That's pretty innovative, I like that. Andrew Conru invents internet, dating circa 1994. I am too shy to slide into your DMs, so just make things easy for me and slide into mine, okay? <gasps> oh, that's what I'm talking about, 20 plus messages. Wait, it's, it's all dudes. Oh, internet dating! I thought it was like internet dating circa Ah, so oh, my dyslexia has, has tricketh me again. Yeah, this is basically how internet dating works. If you switch on like interested in the males, oh my god, you're gonna have so much success. You see, the trick to not being alone is, is just <laughs> play both teams, man. Play both, so easy. Turkey mediates between Ukraine and Russia 2014. Come to Turkey, meet with me. Turkey supports the Russia. I am from Ukraine. Um, uh, Turkey supports Ukraine. I'll support whatever you want, baby. Yes, indeed. I am a very adaptable individual. This feels like one of those movie scenes after like a big battle and there's a survivor that gets picked up from the ocean. They're like, which side were you on? And you're like, um, uh. <laughs> Basically 50-50 chance. Same thing with dating apps and, and catfishing. Liberal arts invented 100 BC. Geometry is a scam. The frick you mean prove it's a triangle? My bro, look at it. It's a triangle. God, I think proof mathematical stuff was my absolute hate thing in school. It's like, oh my god, that's a frick. Uh, the I mean, don't get me wrong, it was satisfying once you managed to prove it because you felt like an independent little po. But uh, my god, most of the time it's just like, what, what do you mean? <laughs> Basically, it's being like being a math lawyer. That's basically what this is. Nostradamus publishes his book of prophecies, 1555. I highly recommend getting off the Kanye train before it inevitably reaches the Hitler was a good guy stop. This was tweeted in 2018. This tweet aged like wine, and the prediction itself aged like really lumpy milk. Yakarunis. Oh, it's Kennedy, a national association for our word and children. TikTok is created 2016. Oh, I mean the timeline is a little messy, messy, but Jesus Christ, man! Like certain things don't age particularly. <laughs> oh, this is so good. This is my favorite. Hard-working American factory worker loses his job to a machine. 1952. Tom was the first guy losing his job because of artificial intelligence. Yeah, look at that little robot cat. I remember this episode from when I was a kid. Absolutely amazing. The Boston Tea Party is formed, 1773. I decided I will no longer be paying taxes. What are they gonna do? <laughs> Tax me more? Go ahead. I won't pay those either. Oh, I'm going to prison. The one paid for by my taxes. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't pay them. Now there is no prison. I'm at least three steps ahead of the government at all times. Oh, yes, indeed. If we just collect 
lap society, there are no consequences, apart from like dying from, you know, really basic infections and stuff. But apart from that, it's gonna be amazing. During the filming of Jurassic Park 1993, T-Rex was known to sweat profusely as it was his first major role in 55 million years. Oh, yeah, Steve, I'm so freaking nervous. I don't worry there, boy. Here, here, let me pad those little forehead for you. Oh, yeah, thanks, Steve. You know, excited. This beautiful, though. Can you imagine if we actually went through that process? Oh, my God, special effects are too difficult. Let's just actually make Jurassic Park and then just film it. Why didn't we do that? I, I want a dinosaur. I want, like, you know, a dog-sized ankylosaurus just roaming my little house, pooping everywhere. It'd be amazing. Maybe that maybe there's a plushie idea, here, like a little dinosaur. Oh my god. Like a like a like a little ankylosaurus or something like that. Oh my god. And I can even have puns with like it goes clubbing because it has a little club on its tail. It's oh oh my god. Twitter's new verification policy come to the Roman Empire, circa 73 BC. No, I am Spartacus. I am the real Spartacus. I am verified as Spartacus. I paid eight dollars to be Spartacus. Man, Twitter and Roman Empire doesn't really match, does it? Mitt Romney and Barack Obama at the final presidential debate 2012. Uh, I would say I'm, I'm pretty decent with faces, fam. I am slightly skeptical. Penis Van Lesbian changed his name to Dick Van D <laughs> to enter showbiz. 1947? <laughs> Oh, that's good. Oh, that's good. I love this one. I uh, take that invader. Queen Elizabeth II defends Windstor Castle against invading forces. 2016. Oh, yes, indeed. Stab that gentleman. Putin sets out his plans for the future of Russia. 2000. How re-establishing the Soviet Union can bring back disco? What is that McDonald's symbol? The little star. What do you, what do you mean disco? Hold on. St. George testing a dragon for COVID, 1914. Well, that's that's a really old-fashioned uh, combat styling for 1914, but there, you see you have a little COVID stick and you shove it into the mouth of the dragon. That is beautiful. I didn't know COVID had an outbreak in, in 1940 and that knights went around poking people in the mouth with long sticks to test it. Dragons are real, though. That's really cool. The 40s sounds amazing, man. Apart from COVID. My grandmother in Korea, 1953. Oh my god, look at that empowered grandma. Oh yes, indeed. Mm, I love a woman who'll actually just shoot me. Passing down the dark arts, 1968. Ozzy Osbourne showing John Lennon how to write heavy metal, 1968. <laughs> this is so good. Oh my, that's amazing. Indeed, Mr. Potter. I will teach you how to rock and roll. <laughs> but Ronald, I'm so nervous. What if I can't get it up? It's love your soul. Okay, well, if you know that cartoon, you are just as cursed as me, and I commend you for it. Thank you. JFK playing on a PS4, circa 2016. Ooh, what a vibe. I mean, it's been a little while since the PS4 came out. I'm a little bit, uh, like, uh, time and stuff can be difficult to put together, but sounds legit. Genghis Khan establishes eco-fascism. <laughs> 1200 AD. Genghis Khan killed so many people that Earth began to cool. 40 million people were wiped off the planet. Vast areas of farmland were reclaimed by the forest, and carbon levels dropped significantly. Okay, so so the, fir the first, like, Greenpeace extremist, this is Genghis Khan. <laughs> For the environment! Uh, beautiful. Beautiful. So many of these posts could just be like, in an alternate universe. It is amazing. I love that. So many movie potentials. Joe Biden receiving one, one, N-word pass from President Barack Obama, 2017. That's beautiful. What happens to, like, the medal once you use it? You can say it once and the medal just dissolves, you know? So, so you can walk around with it and people will know that if you say it, it's gone and then it's, you know, fine. <laughs> ah, the world. Here we can see Mark Zuckerberg in his early childhood, 1986. Look at that. He's just frolicking with the with the other little boys. Nothing to see here. Oh dear God. 911 emergency services begin beta testing, 1968. My wife is going into labor. What should I do? Is this her first child? No, it's her husband. <laughs> Communication is difficult. It's a very punny post. <laughs> I feel like this video has really given birth to a lot of ideas. <laughs> okay, come on, you don't have to call me out on all these puns. <laughs> I must say, though, it is a bit of a labor to come up with so many puns. <laughs> potato farming, 10,000 BC. Red pill me on potato farming. 
<laughs> I read that a hundred square meters of land can produce one ton of potatoes or a thousand euros at retail. Can you get rich if you own a crap ton of land? Anon discovers agriculture. This is how it was, it was green text Anon's just like, hmm, if I grow more potatoes than I eat myself, can I sell it and be a rich bish? And uh, there you go, baby, that was the agricultural revolution. Um, everything comes from the internet. A firefighter from Chernobyl reveals the extent of his injuries. 1986. Oh, look at that. If you look closely, they're actually just sausages. I feel the need to point that out because this is the kind of thing that, you know, YouTube would be like, Oh no, it's so gory. Look at those sausages. But yeah, it's sausages. It's a very funny trick though. It's like, it's like doing this, you know. Oh, 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 my fingy. I think it would work better if my thumbs were a little bit thinner. But yeah, there you go. The British shipping the Great Pyramid of Giza to the British Museum, 1882. A mega typical British museum just taking things to on this. I would be fascinated to see though how large the museum is if they're gonna like house pyramids inside of it. That would be kind of cool just like playing with the thought about it, but, but you know, hooray. The Kennedy assassination, 1985. Oh my god, pew pew! Oh, this- okay, that makes sense. Yeah, that's, um, uh, it's a bit of a- a bit of a throwback to ye olden days of conflict, isn't it? Jeff Bezos admires his weekly paycheck, 2017. <laughs> Precious! <laughs> Can you imagine that? If you just got a le little letter envelope thing, a little package with diamonds, instead of, like, <laughs> boring cash money? Pfft, I want my diamonds. My father left with his high school friend in 1986. Oh, look at that picture. I mean, it's not that weird of a picture. I I have seen Stranger Things. I'm kind of proud of that one. I'm kind of proud of that one. There's nothing you can say to not make me feel proud about that one. Kanye West's grandfather, circa 1938, colorized. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. Oh, oh man. Your mother, 1991. Look at the thickness. Oh, that would go amazing with Newton. Large bodies attract other large curvy bodies. A sickness for the thickness. OnlyFans is launched, 2016. Meow, look at my little buttocks crack. Oh my god, the chickens, they're gonna pay so much for it. The richness, here I come. The first 911 call displaced, 1968. If you're an RN, I need your help ASAP. I am a real N-word, what's wrong? No, I'm talking about a registered nurse. I mean, unless they're asking for, you know, the N-pass medal from Obama. I, <laughs> I think it's a little bit of a disconnect here. What up, fellow squad fam? Here I'm gonna show you how to promote merchandise. Here's a hustler trying to sell merch at Crucifixion 36 AD. Look at this, everyone's hyped up. And you're down the corner, we can see a hustler trying to say merch of Jesus. Oh, is this guy merch is a freaking hustle? Yes. It's the billionaire grind set. First definition of the imperial system. Weights and measures. Act 1824. Tiny Tim is three soy sauce without tail and about four soy sauce with tail. This is literally what it feels like as a European. It is ridiculous. Like, oh my god, it's three feet and a bag long. Hello there, sir. Did you know that you were traveling five hamburgers per shotgun in, in a school zone? Russian gay couple celebrating their wedding anniversary 2016. That is beautiful. Wait, isn't that the- Oh my god, what a little salute! What? You're just jumping from male to male? Oh my god, the drama! Elon Musk selling shares of SpaceX, 1910. He's been at it for a while. Trip to Mars! Trip to Mars, 10 cents. That's pretty cool. Musky Husky looks a little bit different. Maybe it's the hat. It's probably the hat. Judgment Day, 1993. Jesus is a C-word! Mm, yes, indeed. I am disappointed, my son. Time for a little bit of a divine spanking. Idea of Taco Bell, 1849. Alexander Graham Bell. I invented the telephone. His brother, <laughs> Taco. <laughs> I am working on some pretty big stuff, too. Oh, because the last name is Bell, so it's Taco Bell. Oh, oh that's so stupid. I love it. Majorie Taylor Green and her husband take Christmas photos, 2011. I also like to do the Ooga Booga on Twitter. Man on the Moon, 1969. Oh, that's a pretty sus picture right there, not gonna lie. Ah, <sighs> man, the flag looks photoshopped though. This is, oh, the moon landing was fake. It's very sus. 
KGB interrogation techniques used against American police 1985. I am average American man. I work 15 hours in hamburger mines to buy one rock and roll disc. This is a KGB spy being questioned by the police in 1985. <laughs> oh my god, not the glitter mines, please. I love the glitter mines. <laughs> well, laddies, lasses, and lasses, I do hope you enjoyed this video and that you learned something. The most important thing on this channel is education and knowledge. There's nothing more attractive than a big, veiny, throbbing brain. Uh, th th thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you again in the very near future. Take care. Mwah. Thank <laughs> you.